Hi, kids. It's me, Ronald McDonald, and I'm on the set of my very first motion picture ever. It's a movie called Mac and Me, and it stars my little friend from outer space here. His name is Mac, and I want to introduce you to him. Mac? Anybody seen Mac? Where'd he go? What's up, YouTube? It's J-Man and me, the Jokester, back with another movie review. And this time, we've watched quite, quite the entry. Another classic of bad movie cinema. J-Man, what did we watch? Mac. Mac. And That's right, Mac and Me, probably the most famous E.T. ripoff, because it is so terrible. Um, a young boy who, uh, who's in a wheelchair, just like you, uh, is visited by a, an alien who's been separated from his family, and he's got to try to stop the government from taking the alien away, and um, that's the long and short of it, and... Uh, there's a lot of Coca-Cola and there's a lot of McDonald's in this movie because I believe those companies help pay for it. So the aliens drink a lot of Coca-Cola. That's, that's what uh, helps get them along and get them through their adventure. Ah. That's right. Their mouths are already in the soda sipping formation. They can't. They don't get larger than little circles. So perfect for sticking a straw in a Coke can. This is what they do. In fact, I think that in the first scene we see them sipping this through straws on our home planet. Now, J-Man, you have a you have a serious issue with this with with the mother of this film. You think she's not a very good mother. Is that correct? Because she she doesn't prevent her son from going flying off a cliff. That's right. The mother is so upset because uh, one of one of the this one of the decisions the alien makes is he puts all these trees and bushes in the family's house, and the mother is so distracted by that she doesn't realize her son has uh, rolled off in his wheelchair to a, an enormous cliff that's behind their house. Not a great uh, location, if especially if you have a if you have kids at all, especially if you have a kid in a wheelchair. Can cat dog? <laughs> That's a terrible house. Love. That's right. In cat dog, they live on the edge of a cliff. Now another. Uh, you know, as I noted, McDonald's has a heavy presence in this film. So there is a scene at a McDonald's, and who is there? Surprise, surprise, one of your favorite clowns, Ronald McDonald. Hi, Coach. How's it going? Nice getting here. Hi, Eric. How are you feeling? Hey, have you seen my brother yet? Uh, he'll be here soon. Oh, Matt. Did you see that? V and V and V and V American Santa 
I adopt Can I have a turbo? <laughs> well, I think I think you're projecting that last part. They do the aliens do become American citizens at the end, which happened a lot in movies in the late eighties it seemed. And then the last scene, the aliens are driving the kids without their mother in a big pink convertible. I think you wanted the aliens to adopt the kids because you thought the mother was so bad. The mother also wasn't the mother also wasn't there when the kids get into that grocery store shootout where the there's all those flames and the mother couldn't prevent them from uh, stealing that minivan and rescuing the aliens and getting in trouble at the grocery store. That's right, she, the mother was not present for that big dance sequence at McDonald's. Do you think, what do you, what do you think about Ronald McDonald being in this movie? Did it, you seem kind of excited when you saw Ronald. Yeah, that's that's your theory as to why the Hamburglar is not in this movie because he was in prison for his crimes. Have found and and but Mac blow the giant and this will be back actually very wise make a sequel no they're not um, that was false advertising so they got a little uh share themselves. <laughs> Just gonna, I'll be sitting like this for the rest of the night. J-Man, if an alien came to Earth and asked you to help help find his family in the desert, would you help it? Yeah. yeah. If an alien came to Earth and asked you to give it a bunch of Coca-Cola, would you give the alien Coca-Cola? Sure. <laughs> If an alien said, let's go to McDonald's and have a dance party with Ronald McDonald, would you do that? Sure. <laughs> we <laughs> we'll see you next time, YouTube. Thanks for tuning in. We love you, and we'll catch you later. Okay, make the Mac and me face. Make the alien face. Bring it's bringing love! Don't let it get away! Break its legs!